how I stumbled upon Walk the Talk America. And I was a little bit weary at first. I wasn't sure how, if there was still a chance, like you guys could be like a no compromise and talk about mental health. And the more I learned, I quickly, I quickly learned that, yes, you guys are amazing and somehow have brought the two worlds together and made like the perfect combination. And you truly did bridge that gap between the two. And it just, it really, it made everything make sense for me and how I could continue on. And I immediately like went onto your website and you guys have really, really good resources um, on your website for training people on how to talk about this or how to um, understand the two-way community better. And then you have more training on how to understand the mental health side of it better. And I, it was a year and a half ago, so I don't know exactly what I watched on your websites, but I watched them all. (laughs) And I was like, I have to, I want to be certified. I want to know how to talk about this because I knew that I was about to walk into spaces where it was going to matter. And I also knew that I had, I myself had, you know, a husband with PTSD and it, for my own family, it was so important that I understood this and um, continued to keep the conversation open. And it really has given us the permission to do that. So um, every time after that, I real I saw that you could um, have those cards that you could take and then you could put on um, a therapist on the back of it. I thought those were amazing. So I printed those off and and my first event that I had with Empower 2A, it was March, um, uh, two years ago, it was in March. And uh, I, I set that at everybody's table. And I said, you know, we're going to talk about this. So when I did my intro, I start out with, hey, I am Katie Gardner and I'm a part of Empower 2A. But first, I would love to share with you what Walk the Talk is, Walk the Talk America. And I said, right now you have this at your table. And I think this is so important. I tell them what you're all about. And then I just give them that permission. That's an open conversation for the rest of the day. I do that at all of my events. Every time I walk into a CPL class to talk about Empowered 2A, I talk about Walk the Talk America. 